The bar is back open for business. Cheers! 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 Oh, cheers. Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. On a night filled with lots of hugs and laughs, the cast reunited. And where better to do it than a bar? <laughs> For Rhea Perlman, feeling the love from old friends would have extra meaning. Today, E.T. has learned Rhea and her husband, Danny DeVito, have separated after more than 30 years of marriage. They met in 1970 and lived together 12 years before marrying in 1982. The couple have three children. Rhea's two daughters were her dates for the reunion. Sometimes you want to go where So how does it feel to be back together? Is it like old hat already? The old word kind of fits in. <laughs> I don't you know about guys the do hat. not look 30 years older. I have to say, you just don't. Do you feel 30 years older? Girl? Parts of my Parts body, of yeah. Us. The beauty of working in a bar is it's not like we worked in a high school where we were too old to do a TV special. So <laughs> I'm looking forward to that Cheers Christmas special right. every year. Sure. Everybody with walkers. <laughs> we could be 160. Who cares? Sorry. We're closed. Cheers closed its doors after 11 seasons, all on DVD, but everybody still knows their names. Sam, Diane, Rebecca, Lilith, Cliff, and of course, Norm. Norm! Now look down the bar and take one of George on the phone. Get in here, Georgie. Have you guys been able to see each other over the past 30 years? Well, we, one, once a month, we, for years, we met at Ted's house on Thursday, played Twister. Did you really? Yeah. You're not kidding, we, right? But then you moved. There was a fight. We had a really ugly fight. Oh, it was, it was yeah. Sorry. I see everybody. <laughs> I do. I see every see single you? person. But just all not the all at the same time. But you get to see them throughout the year. Yeah. Is it because it was such a close bond on the show? Is that why? You just you couldn't, you couldn't get rid of anybody? You loved them too much? No, I, I worked with Shelly uh, earlier this year. I was dropping on BB when I'm in New York. Teddy, I, you see you more in New York than, than I do in, in L.A. John and I do the odd, uh, odd appearance together. I show up in his audience when he's on Broadway. I'm living back there now, so uh, so we, we surprise George from time to time. You guys have supported each other through the years, huh? I saw Woody in July. I went to see his play. That was fun. Wow. How was that? How nice. Well, it's for Adolph. Hey, have you all seen the film Ted? Ted? No, Ted was... Uh, Mark Wahlberg. Yeah. yeah. They asked me to do a little teeny cameo where I played Ted Danson on acid, cocaine, <laughs> the, the evil Ted, talking about the Cheers years as and on an interview. And they cut most of it, but the one line they kept was at the end I said, and Woody Harrelson, smallest penis I've ever seen on an actor. <laughs> it's in the movie. It made me so happy. <laughs> Possible to replace this cast. <laughs> kind of course. Are you? Have you been drinking? <laughs> she may have been late to the party, but Kirsty was definitely ready to reunite. <laughs> Kirsty showed up with Dan Cortese, her Veronica's Closet co-star, but this night was all about Cheers. Do you guys think that Cheers was the best sitcom that ever existed on television? Yeah. 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 <laughs> that was easy. It's an embarrassing question. We can't answer that. It's an embarrassing riches. Just say yes. 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 Just say yes. Like is, is my camera close? <laughs> yes. Hello, everyone. No! That's better. Sometimes you want to go where everybody... I've never met an intelligent woman that I'd want to date. On behalf of the intelligent women around the world, <laughs> may I just say... <laughs> now a television legend, low ratings almost had Cheers canceled in its first season. Do you remember what that first year was like and wondering whether the show would continue? I think they protected us. I didn't really think about it. Yes, Grant Tinker, then president of NBC, believed in the show. Because all his uh, people around him were telling him to cancel the show because we're dead last in the ratings. He said, no, it makes me laugh. And so he kept it and gave us another year. And that's September, 
second first week of the second season, we won a Bush of Basketball of Emmys. Over 11 seasons, the show earned 28 Emmys, four of them for Best Comedy. By the end of its run, an amazing 26 million viewers were still tuning in. So how would your lives have been different had that not happened, where it continued on for so many years? Well, she'd be on Broadway like she is, so nothing would change there. I'd be still repairing combine harvesters. Right. <laughs> I'd be running a sober living environment. No! I'm up, I'm up. One, uh, one quick one, then I really got to fly. What do you watch today? I watch old Mary Tyler Moore shows. Do you really? Yeah, and another show that I watch is um, Cheers. <laughs> you watch it every run? I, I do. I, I watch it, and it cracks me up. I am going to kiss you. In fact, I'm going to kiss you like you've never... <laughs> it is funny. It's so funny. It is. it is funny, and I love seeing my friends yeah. make me laugh. Yeah. Well, you never see the jokes coming. You forget them. For two reasons. One, we were pretty good, and two, I'm totally forgetful and can't remember a single thing I did that I long ago. remember the lines then. Missing from this free-for-all, Woody Harrelson on location with the Hunger Games sequel, and Kelsey Grammer in London promoting his series, Boss. As for the rest of the Cheers stars, perhaps the next time you'll see them with Ted is on CSI. Have you tried to recruit any of them to be murderers or victims on your I'd show? I like have all of them on the slab at some time. <laughs> <laughs> have you on the slab at some time or another on his show. They don't know that I'm on a TV show. You'll have to tell them. What does that have to do with slabs? You'll have to tell them. Yeah, he's on a kind of a large show them. right now. <laughs> Good for you. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Yeah, so you still found work after all. Yeah, yeah.